Hey guys, welcome to MNMM Plants and Pets. Uh, the reason I'm here today is that I want to share few plants that I feel are the best for beginners, indoor plants for beginners, okay? Now, there are a lot of people out there who want to do gardening, but they don't have time. Maybe they are working or maybe they don't have much interest, but they do want to have some plants in their lives. This video is definitely for you. So if you're looking for more of such updates, videos and knowledge about plants and pets, do subscribe my channel, hit the bell icon for the latest updates. All right, so the first plant that I have is one of my favorites and that is spider plant. Now this plant, as you can see on your screen, I bought it like around four years ago and this has been with me from four years. And there have been times where uh, when I have been on holidays for a month and still this plant hasn't died. I water it uh, twice or maybe thrice maximum a month okay so this plant is something that does not require any attention if you have kept your spider plant in a well lit room where it is not getting direct sunlight and you're only watering it once in two weeks your spider plant is never going to die and it's very easy to propagate it as well so if you are seeing baby spider plants you can easily chop them off and plant it in another soil and what you will see is that your spider plant is doing magic and this is honestly one of the easiest ones to have next is snake plant now this plant is someone that is actually difficult to kill i would say not difficult to have difficult to kill if you water your snake plant once in a month I think that's more than enough if your snake plant is inside your house. So I would suggest to have your snake plants inside your house or in your offices or your desk wherever you're working and uh, it will do magic because you do not need to fertilize it. You do not need to take any 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 care of this plant and you can simply water it once or maximum twice a month and your snake plant is never going to die. And the best thing is that there are so many varieties available of snake plant that what you can do is if you have a big pot, you can plant like six, seven varieties of snake plant in one pot so that it looks very colorful and very diverse. The next plant is called ZZ plant. This plant is again one of the hardest plants I've ever seen. I have a story that I will share about this plant. I read it on Facebook a couple of days ago that a lady had this plant on her uh, work workplace desk and uh, she went to the workplace after four months because of the COVID and what she saw was even after even the plant did not receive any water for four months on her desk, it was still alive. Now imagine a plant you have in your house and you are not watering it for one month and it is still alive. What more can you expect from a plant? It never complains. There is no need to add any fertilizer. Just plant it in a pot for once and leave it. Please water it once in two or three weeks and do not water it more than that. That's it and ZZ plant will always be green and shiny for you. Next plant is Devil's Ivy or Pothos or Money Plant or whatever name you want to give it. This plant is one of the most common house plants or you might have seen this in offices or any other workplaces. The reason is it looks beautiful and also it is an air purifier plant. Now again this plant is not a lot of high maintenance, maybe a little bit care but not a lot of care. Now. When I say a little bit care, what do I mean? If you have planted this, uh, if you are going to plant your pothos, what I, I would suggest is the day you are planting it, just add some organic compost to it and that's it. As you can see, my uh, money plant, it's there with me from one and a half years now and I have never given it any compost or anything since one and a half years and I only water this uh, once a week or sometimes once in two weeks when it's winter and it's doing great. It's, uh, you know, available in millions of varieties so what i would recommend is that you can have three four varieties in one big pot or if you want to plant it in water you can try that as well if you are fond of ferns but you feel that you're not able to take care of them guess what the next one is for you bird nest one one of my favorite ferns the reason is fern itself is a name which brings a lot of care and attention to any passionate gardeners because we know that ferns require a lot of attention and they are very demanding in nature but guess what this plant bird nest fern is one such fern which does not require any attention the fern that you see that i have 
honestly i water this fern like once in 2 weeks and still it never died and i am not doing anything special so the day you get your bird nest fern just pot it properly water it once in 2 weeks and uh, it will do great there is not much to do about and what you can do is if it is a very hot day or if it is summers going on what you can do is before sleeping at night just put some cold water in a a spray bottle and when you wake up in the morning just spray some water on all of your plants if it is summer please don't do this in winters or rainy days only in summers and your house plants will be very very happy the reason i wanted to share these plants is not just because they are very easy to take care of they are very cheap as well in the market one of the reasons that i suggest highly recommend these plants is they are best air purifiers as well for example your spider plant your devil's ivy your snake plant your zizi plant they are all air purifiers so if you have them inside your bedroom or inside your house guess what you're breathing safe you're breathing healthy and you're leading a healthy life So hope this video helped you a lot. If you are a beginner, start getting them one by one and keep me updated if uh, you need any help regarding maintaining them. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon for the latest updates. Bye bye. Take care.